What's going on guys? Scott Carell here from scottcarellonline.com. Hope you're having a great day. January 3rd, 2016, first video of the new year. I did that for a purpose. I did that for a reason. So the topic today, guys, is why your top resolutions, why your top resolutions for the new year will continuously fail unless you do these, un unless you do these things. Okay, so let's talk about resolutions first. Um, who makes a resolution? Who makes a New Year's resolution? Raise your hand if you have. Okay, I've done it in the past. All right, I'm going to go out on a limb here, and I don't mean to offend anybody, but New Year's resolutions, by and large, for the most part, never become fulfilled. Never. So I learned a while back, stop making New Year's resolutions. Take them, throw them out. Okay? No more New Year's resolutions, and I'll tell you why. Because we, we take this big, grandiose idea, which is fine to have, but we have to put it in the proper context. You can't end December 31st, oh, 2015 was this, this, and this, and 2016 is going to be my year. It's going to be my year because... And you make these big, huge, sweeping changes... And you're looking a year out, I'm going to be this and that and the other. My question to you is, have you decided what you're going to do today in order to become that person that you want to be at the end of this year? Don't say, my New Year's resolution is to make a million dollars. Create a daily plan on how to get there. Become that person. Work on you every single day. Make a commitment. Don't make a New Year's resolution. Make a commitment to yourself. Scott, what's the bit? What's the difference? What's the difference between making a New Year's resolution and making a commitment to yourself? There's a huge difference. A resolution is you're declaring that you're going to do this, this, and this by the end of the year. If you're making a commitment to yourself, you're saying, I'm going to do A, B, C today to make myself a better person, to make myself more successful, to make myself a little bit smarter, to make my relationships a little bit better. I'm going to make a commitment to myself to do these things now. And then I'm going to do them again tomorrow. And then I'm going to do them again the next day. All right? I'm not preaching, guys. I'm on the journey, just like you. Okay? So these are just things that I've learned that I'm kind of sharing. So New Year's resolutions, throw that stuff out. Make a commitment to you. Make a commitment to be better. Make a commitment to yourself to do the things that you need to do in order to get to where you need to be. Who do you need to become? Who is the person that you need to become in order to get to that spot, that place, that success level, uh, that success in your relationship, whatever your goal is, okay? If it's in business, awesome. If it's in relationships, awesome. It's if, it, if it's in fitness, awesome. Okay, whatever it is that your goals are, make a commitment to you. Do it now. Okay, and uh, that's all I have, guys. So, um, just throwing this out there. It's been a while since uh, since I've, I've made a video, so uh, I'm back on the horse here. <sighs> every Wednesday night, 9 p.m. Every Wednesday night, 9 p.m. Eastern, uh, we have some training, some marketing. I don't care what uh, niche you're doing, what niche you're in. There is value to be gained for you, for free, giving this training to you. So scottcarell.net, it's in the link, you can click it, uh, but scottcarell.net, go there every Wednesday night at 9, check out the training, it's good for what ails you. All right, guys, live on purpose, live with gratitude, success is a choice. I'll catch you next time.